And moving on. Wow. And there we go, his third star for a reason. Learn the ability Black Magic Avoidance plus 20. Damn. I didn't know I could do that. Neither did I. That's great. Um, we'll keep getting you up to at least D rank though. D minus. Damn, she's B rank in armor now. Definitely no need to train that. Hmm. You know, let's target Dorothea's uh budding talent in Faith. And we got her her first star. Great. That's that. Um. Everyone has their goals already. Alright, begin the lecture. Professor. I believe I am better suited to healing than to fighting. Rather than train with traditional weapons, then, I think it would best be uh, best for me to focus upon my faith. Focus on reason and authority skills. Update 2. Focus on faith to uh, excel as a bishop. Um... Yeah, sure. Don't nod off there, Claude. Oh, it's Ash's birthday. Uh, let's give him some flowers. Thank you very much. It's finished. Good job, Marianne. And Leonie. Only good this time, though. will master this. Good job. Nice. Oh. Yeah, I've got this Defensive down. tactics. I'm a quick study. Wonderful. Now right, what do we got? There's the one more um, battle, but uh, we're going to go to this golden fish. Something's changed in the fishing pond, and there are now many fish with a golden glow. This could be your chance to get rich quick, and then bonding bites. Fantastic. Ooh, but um, we have that advanced, uh, whatchamacallit. I don't think anyone can actually go yet, though. Hmm, but Cyril can. Let's go ahead and make uh, Cyril a fighter. There you go. I passed. Good job. I'm surprised at how much they're giving me. Is he actually in my class? Did I actually recruit him fully? I suppose it's possible. I didn't actually uh, get the. I accidentally clicked on that one option. I didn't get a chance to read it. And it was at the top of the menu, so that's usually where the recruit is. Hmm. Well. Can't get there yet, huh? Is it a lack of a seal or is it because you haven't mastered a previous class? Alrighty. Let's go ahead and explore. Who knows, maybe we can do that tournament now. Sorry, but victory Things are going much better this time. Uh, let's see, 9, 26, do we have two times hits? No. So it'll be... I get hit, f I hit first, 13, 9, another 13, another 9, another, th okay, we should be fine. Oh, you're dead. 
It was a good try. We're not dead, but you know. Quarterfinal's good. Now we can restore. This is where we lost last time in the semis with Felix. Ow. I don't know what that move is he used, but an outsider. Felix is powerful. Oh, I think it's like a vanguard kind of thing. Where he gets to attack first, maybe? Oh, Petra. It's definitely a uh, heal. All right, looks like we shouldn't have any trouble winning this one. Excellent. Good try. Just what we needed. A couple more levels for uh, Claude. Like one. Or two. And yes, the professor level is what I really wanted. Fantastic. Hello, Edelgard. Edel. What an interesting relationship there. All right, fishing time. Let's go with, ooh, herring bait. Start with insect larva. See what comes out. Oh yeah, perfect. Air me to Gobi. Nice. Five star. Herring bait. Let's do this. Best fish we can get. A white trout. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Come on. Shit. Damn it. Only good. Platinum fish. Oh, I wonder if I can get multiple platinums. All right, here we go. Here we go. Yes! Perfect. Oh, this one's only 500, though. That's fine. Now I know it's possible to get multiple. Another one in a row. Fantastic. I got two that time. I'm also hoping to get a professor level from all this fishing. <laughs> all right, one more. Damn it. Awesome. Uh, a silverfish. Eh. <clears throat> Alright, that's enough fishing for now. I think he actually is. Uh, I did recruit him on accident, I think. Um, let's harvest. Ooh, rocky burdock, whatever that is. There we go. Let's go ahead and share a meal. Um, let's see, not Claude. Lorenz, Leone. Leone and Raphael, why not? That looks delicious. Goddess, forgive me. I've just got to indulge. Feel free. This is delicious. Everything's your absolute favorite, favorite, Raphael. <laughs> there we go. Finally, another professor level. Ooh, it's a B. Fantastic. Have more exp 
exploration and instructing points. And we have more adjutants now. And I'm glad I waited to plant flowers because now I have four of them. Use Caledonian soil. That doesn't seem to uh, have any benefit there. Just in few, we'll, we'll prune them. Excellent. What's left? Training? I suppose I could also eat them another meal or two. Just give them flowers to raise their uh, um, motivation. Instead of the uh, the other thing. Alright, I've been giving everyone flowers all around the place, but now it's time to do the note. Let's see, I've slept almost everywhere in this monastery, but lately I've been wanting to try sleeping outdoors. Do you know where uh, somewhere I could sleep under the stars? Chilly and ominous graveyard? No. Courtyard full of blooming flowers. Ooh. I think the blooming flowers. Ooh, no, the star terrace. No? Maybe he would like the graveyard. Still not nearly enough for now. See you again soon. Need another thousand. Ooh, we have supports, that's right. Um. Ooh, I learned fire. I wonder if I have any other interesting skills to learn. I'm not going to. I'm surprisingly low in my swordsmanship. Though to be fair, I don't train my skills as much as I do my students. There we go. Bane of Monsters, nice. The glory. Yes, Lady Rhea. Would you like to train my reason? Thank you. All right, our last training. That's it. <laughs> That we'll do is, I guess, swordsmanship with uh, Catherine, since I don't really see anyone else to do reason with. Lovely. But before we actually leave, leave. Hello, doggy. We can do some supports. Oh, we have a bunch of them ready. Let's start with Marianne and Leone. Hmm. Oh, hey, Marianne. Sup? Um, uh, Leone? I forget what you guys were doing last time. I think she was giving you some hard words, Marianne. I thought greenhouse duty was mine today. What are you doing here? Oh, I. Uh... It's okay, Marianne. Take your time. I'm sorry. You've been avoiding me ever since I lost my temper, haven't you? You're probably scared of me now. Oh, Leonie's not gonna hurt anyone. In the moment, I was hurt. I'm sure you had good reasons to act the way you did. If you want me to leave you alone, I will. I promise, you've got nothing to fear from me. Oh. Leonie, I... Marianne's just, uh... Needs a little space sometimes. I've watered all the plants, so I'm done here. I'll get out of your way. But I think she does want you to completely avoid her. Wait. Huh? Hey, what is it? It's um. Take your time. I don't mean to bother you. I'm sorry for keeping you here. Stop that! Just you don't need to be sorry. No, not at all. Thanks for keeping me. Honestly, I've been worried about you. Yeah. If you ever want to talk about anything, just say so. I'll make time. Yeah, he's a good friend. I've been avoiding people for most of my life, so I'm not the best at speaking. Oh. I know it's hard. You've been through a lot. But it's worth the extra effort to talk to your friends. It is. I make everyone uncomfortable. I just don't know how to carry on a conversation. 
Oh, Marianne. Hey, we're having one right now. Exactly. And I'm telling you, I'm not uncomfortable. I'm actually really happy. So don't worry about me. And it's okay to be quiet sometimes. But try to find a middle ground at least. Otherwise, you'll never get any better. Mm, Leonie dropping the, uh, the good advice here. Oh. As far as what to talk about, anything's good. Hobbies, things you like, a dream you had last night. Really. You anything. guys could talk about Dorte the horse. Okay, then. I, um... <laughs> Like this flower. I think it's This nice. is actually really adorable. I think so too. Did you know that where I come from, those have a completely different color? Really now. Oh, really? I'd like to see that. See they're bonding. Great. Come visit my village someday. In fact, we should invite all of our friends. It'll be fun. Uh, that would require Marianne to leave the monastery. Let's see how this plays out. Oh yes. Aww. That would be very that is lovely. I'm glad we got this moment. Alrighty. Lysithia. Lysithia and Hilda. Okay. Ah, found you. Hello, Lysithia. Lysithia. Now how are you are you how are you gonna reject or say you're busy this time, if at all? Uh Hilda? What's that box you're holding? What box? It's making me nervous for some reason. Probably for good reason. <laughs> Your big sister Hilda's here, and she's going to make you look all grown up. Uh-oh. I, uh, don't recall ever asking you to... Uh-oh. Run, right. Lysithia. I exactly what you needed. You didn't have to ask. Now take a... Run, Lysithia, before it's too late. With makeup, you can't just pick your favorite colors. You must choose colors <gasps> that suit you and the occasion. What color would suit Lysithia? Hmm. If you'll be up close and personal, if you're going to a ball, for example, you want to keep it subtle. This is... Hilda really is quite the big sister, isn't she? She acts like it. It's nice. On the other hand... If you're going to be on stage, the color should be overt. <laughs> I don't think you have to worry about that with Lysithia. I don't think she's the stage presence. Uh, I've never used makeup before. It sounds complicated. Much too complicated. Let's put up your hair to show off your neck. But we'll leave a few strands hanging to make you look more vulnerable. Man, full on makeover. Why would I want to appear vulnerable? I don't want to be attacked. <laughs> and taking a little too literally. <laughs> this is for wooing, not warring. When you're older, you might understand the importance of looking a little vulnerable. Like this delicate flower Hilda, who can take a blow like no other. From a backside of a broadsword. Ugh, you're treating me like a child. But I guess it's mostly harmless. Or even a battle axe. Now, when you're standing, put your non-dominant foot a step back. It looks more elegant. <laughs> this is interesting. When sitting, don't lean back, but don't slouch either. And ensure at all times you are gracefully extending your fingers. Mm, going through both etiquette and... I don't know, what would you call that? Ladyship? But like noble... Noble ladies? I don't know if there's a name for it. Maybe just etiquette. Standing? <laughs> uh, suddenly standing and sitting are an exhausting activity. Seriously. Hilda, that's enough. This is wearing me out. Hmm. The studious, always working Lysithia worn out by makeup and sitting and standing. Hilda or Lysithia, I think you've met your match. I knew you had potential. You'll go far, my darling. <laughs> it's too bad this is their last one together. A couple of years to develop your charms, and no girl will outmatch you. Too bad we don't get to see the results of Hilda's work. I'm not sure I'm cut out for this type of thing. Oh, Nonsense. Me, you are. With a little help from me, you'll have men falling at your feet. <laughs> no thanks. 
You're more suited to such things. I'll leave it to you. <laughs> I mean, there's... That's okay. You have yours. I haven't the time or the energy to fuss over how I'm perceived. Even with my best efforts, I'll never be as good at this as you are. I mean, no one can put an effort like it, uh, like Scythia. Still, this was rather fun. Thank you, Hilda. Oh, there we go. Glad you at least enjoyed it. She really is brimming with untapped potential. You're telling me. She will make an amazing mage and probably even leader of her house someday. And she smiles like that. Wow. Even my heart skips a beat. She is noble, right? I always forget who is and isn't. Oh. Oh, another one with the Byleth. Alrighty then. Huh. Even though it shows, it says it'll take some time before you can deepen that bond. Does that mean it's close to deepening? Oh, here we go. Welcome, Professor. This is the first time I have welcomed you here, is it not? This is your room. Nice bed. <laughs> there is no need to be nervous. Please, come closer. Uh, Rhea? When you speak with me here in this room, you are not speaking with the Archbishop, but with Rhea. It's just me. <laughs> Understood. <laughs> I'm still nervous. Uh, understood. <laughs> Such a sweet child. I mean, you are one of the, probably one of the most powerful, if not like physical brute might. You just share authority. One of the most powerful people on this, well, either in the world or in this country, or set of countries. My apologies. I should not be treating you like a child. Yeah, how old are you even? I don't even know my age. As Gerald's kin, somehow you don't seem at all a stranger to me. Speaking of Gerald, may I ask if he ever spoke of me to you? Mm, yeah, I'm sorry, Rhea, he is not. He said you were frightening. <laughs> he never mentioned he said you were incredible. And now he never mentioned. Oh dear, how heartless of him. Yeah. In any case, let us endeavor to become closer from here on out. What was your relationship to my father? <laughs> Since you are here, shall I tell you about the Gerald that I knew? Ooh, some juicy gossip, huh? Let's let's go sit down first. By the look of it. You haven't heard much about his time at the monastery, have you? Not a word. When I first met Gerald, he was quite young. Why, he could not even grow a full beard oh, wow. at that point. Quite young indeed, then. On one fateful occasion, the band of mercenaries he belonged to fought alongside the Knights of Saros. Hmm. Were they by chance the Grail mercenaries? <laughs> no. I was traveling with the knights at the time, and Gerald jumped in front of an attack. Oh, actually, he was gravely wounded, on the verge of death. Now that I think about it, he does have a vague resemblance to uh, Ike's father too, doesn't he? Or maybe I'm misremembering. Same hair color, I think, though. I tended to his wounds in a desperate attempt to save his life. Thankfully, my efforts were not in vain. Gerald managed to escape a seemingly certain death. Damn. I made arrangements for him to receive further care at Garrick Mock. The moment he was deemed fully recovered, I invited him to join the Knights. And he accepted? I didn't know. Thank you for telling me. Well, it is not a story I have often repeated. <laughs> Even at the monastery, there are not many who know that. I tell you this because, to me, you are the child of the one who saved my life all those years ago. Well... And also... Uh-oh. What? Never mind. 
It is nothing. I Damn it. simply wanted to say that I trust you. Damn it. Well then. You're not my mom, are you? The grave out there isn't fake or anything. No. But did you have a fling with Gerald, perhaps? By coming to visit with me today, you have... Well, suffice it to say that my day is brighter than it otherwise would have been. I thank you for that. Hmm. That's nice. Here we go. Yes, Slicethia. It is absolutely a good time. Want to talk about ghosts? We were right by the graveyard. Professor, thank you for helping me with my training. Oh, you're more than welcome. Anytime. I'd love to do this again if possible. Your advice is always so useful. I'm glad I could help. Everyone thinks you're a wonderful teacher. You account for people's weaknesses while capitalizing on their strengths. I, I do try. Initially, I wasn't sure you paid too much attention to your students. Clearly, I was wrong. Well, I'm glad I've earned your respect, Lysithia. After all, were that the case, you wouldn't be capable of providing such useful feedback. <laughs> I'll continue to learn and grow from your instruction, Professor. I just know it. Hmm. That is... Ah. Oh. The words every teacher wants to hear. You're quite determined. You think I'm determined? Yep. Yes, always pushing yourself indeed. Professor, I... Thank you. I mean, you are the hardest work... I mean, Raphael works hard in a different way. But you are the most... Yeah, uh, determined. Uh, determined is a good word for it. Out of all of my students. Praised me like that. You sure about that? I feel like others have praised you before, but you always take it the wrong way. I mean, people are always telling me I've got a knack for magic. I mean, you do. If you can call the power of my crest a knack, they aren't wrong per se. I forget what your crest does. Though bearing two crests isn't a gift I ever asked for. Oh. Anyhow, yeah. I've made a point to work harder than most and not rely too heavily on the power they bestow. Mm. So I find it frustrating that the only praise I seem to receive is directly related to that power. I see. You, um, feel people are praising something that is out of your control instead of what you can control. I can get that. If you've noticed how hard I work, then well, it just... It makes me very happy. <laughs> Why do you work yourself so hard? Well, you see, I... It is because I am the only child of House Ordelia. I must do all I can for my family name. You're doing quite a lot. You'll make a good successor to your house, I imagine. I'm determined to someday be of real value to them. And that day must come soon. Hmm, <laughs> I'm sure you already are. I can't waste any time. I don't have much of it left. What? You mean till you're grown up, or...? Anyway, I should be going. Thank you again for your help. Um... Lysithia, do you want to expand on that? I am all of a sudden very worried for you. The way she said that. Hello, Raphael. Hopefully you have a less... Great timing, Professor. Well. I was just going to come find you. Ominous support. How's it going, Raphael? Are you busy? I have a question about formations. Mm, go ahead. What? Shoot. I don't understand them at all. Oh. <laughs> Are the speed of battle and the terrain connected somehow? There's too much to memorize. I mean... Yeah. You don't have to remember everything. I don't? Then what do I have to know? How to punch... Um... I guess it really depends on what role you want to have. I think I understand the basics. To start, you just... 
Ah, okay. I think I've got it. Ah, awesome. Thanks for the help, Professor. Brains and brawn. You've really got it all. Yes, that is why I am the professor. With your help, I should have no trouble becoming a proper knight. <laughs> You'll make a fine knight. A fine one indeed, Raphael. Why do you want to be a knight? Huh? Didn't I tell you? No. My parents were merchants of the Alliance. They died in an accident. Oh. That's why it's up to me to look after my little sis. Oh, and you take such good care of her too. Did you ever send that necklace? I'm not great with bookkeeping, so I don't think I'd make a good merchant. <laughs> yes, uh, I won't deny that. No, I don't think that's your best career path. I talked to Grandpa, and he suggested I become a knight. So I sold all our valuables and used the money to pay my way into the academy. Damn. My sis won't survive if I get kicked out, so I can't give up now. Don't worry, Raphael, you will go far. Did you consider becoming a mercenary? I might have tried being a mercenary if I didn't have my little sis to look after. That's fair. I probably shouldn't say this, but being a mercenary does sound like an easier life. <laughs> hey now. Mercenaries have no responsibilities and no one else to worry about. Hey now. I had my dad to worry about. But someone's got to take care of my little sis. So that's out of the question. Mm. Serving as a knight in a noble house is more secure. True. And you don't have to worry about dying unless there's a war. Oh, yeah. My sis has been through so much. I don't want her to have to worry about me. Well, that is very kind of you. I promise to try and keep you safe for her. Hey, do you have any siblings, Professor? Nope. Then you probably think I'm missing out on my freedom, having to support her, huh? No, I think it's very sweet. But working hard for my sister isn't too bad. Call it a burden, call it a challenge. If it makes my sister happy, I'm happy too. He is just a great guy. You should ask your father to have some more kids. <laughs> I think he'll pass. Anyway, that's why I've got to become a proper knight. Well, good luck to you, Raphael. And with that, I think we are done. Time to end today's free time. Oh, and time to instruct. So we're giving all those flowers comes in handy. Thanks for Aw, oh, sweet. Budding talent achieved. Good job, Bernie. Ooh, pass. I guess I've got some talent. Yes, you do. I got it right. Alrighty. That's all of them. Let's go ahead and, ooh, actually, um, goals, goals, lane, passion to heal. We should keep her, hmm, training with faith, uh, we could keep her training with faith, um, or, could also continue working on magic. No do reason and faith. Professor. Hello, Cyril. I used to look after wyverns back in Elmira, Elmira, so I know how to handle them. I can ride one into battle, but it'd be nice if you helped me out. Uh, help me work on my axe and flying skills. Oh. Sure. You want to be a wyvern rider? I won't turn that down. Cyril's birthday. You know, I've never done a tea party for him. Sure. Let's do mint leaves. Do you need me for something, Professor? We're here for a tea party. Thanks. <sighs> Gotta cool Be careful. Down. Yeah, it's hot, yeah. It's steaming. Gifts you'd like to receive. I heard. Gifts you'd like to receive. Uh. The existence of crests? No. I heard some gossip. <laughs> that was a tough what? one. 
your ambitions. And let's see if we can go for a perfect. Favorite sweet strange fish in the pond. Relaxing at the sauna. Well, let's do strange fish. Fantastic. Perfect tea time. If I got kicked out of the monastery, I'd have no other place to go. That'd be bad. Huh. <sighs> no. That was still a great tea time, though. Well, I still got some work to get done. Thanks. For no problem, Cyril. See you next time, next birthday. Oh, my charm increased. Ooh, nice. That wasn't so bad. Good. Mm, nice. A grasp on this. Ooh, reason level four. This isn't so hard. Lance breaker. Nice. Time for more battles. All right, with the uh, new battalions assigned haphazardly to people who they don't actually benefit kind of hurt even a little bit. Let's go to the next paralogue. Mm hmm. Land of the Golden Deer. Ah, oh, perfection. All oh, these tea leaves are just divine. Quite Ooh. the impressive selection, if I do say so myself. Mmm, delicious. Hey, Cyril. So this is where you are. Hello, Cyril. Lured here by the exquisite aroma, were you? Is Cyril part of this one? I didn't see his name listed. Uh, no. I've got a thing Oh, for he's you. just delivering. It's a letter. All right. Well, don't say I didn't deliver it. <laughs> a letter for me, is it? Curious. You never get letters there, Lawrence. Let's see what we have here. Uh-oh. Is that a love letter? Or, huh? So who's it from? Hello, Professor. It is a rare correspondence from my father, as it happens. Ah. Some difficulty with Acheron, apparently. My father wishes me to return home and settle it. You know, I don't give you enough credit, Lawrence. You take everything in stride. And are very, you know, doing your best to do your duty. Acheron? A young lord whose domain borders my father's. Do you know of the Great Bridge of Murden? I've heard of it. It is an old bridge across the Aramid River, a key crossing between Alliance and Empire territory. Mm, yes. Acheron controls the land on the northern side. We can have the bridge map now. Controlling such an essential location gives him quite a bit of clout, which he is ever so eager to deploy toward the purpose of stirring up trouble. This time, he is dredging up an old border dispute that was supposed to be settled some time ago. Ah. He has even begun to dispatch military forces. Shit. It is best we rout his troops before they cause any damage to the surrounding villages. I would agree. What is this faulty- what is this faulty you, Lawrence? To my father, Acheron is insignificant in the face of far more pressing political matters. Ah, uh, damn it. Other houses wield far greater power and influence. Goneril, Ordelia, Edmund, and of course, Regan. I know Regan and Ordelia. I probably know Edmund and Goneril, but I can't place who's in those houses. But we have Lysithia and Claude. To make his voice heard at the round table conferences, my father must keep up relations with them. Mm, so he's busy trying to keep his position, his influence. That is simply the way the Leicester Alliance works. It was, after all, founded with the goal of freedom from Fargus. We prize that independence highly, even if it occasionally hinders cooperation. That's fair. There is often talk of mutual aid, but the truth is that each noble acts to maximize personal benefit. It is an alliance, not a kingdom. At the moment, the Regan dukedom is in no state to keep those conflicting motivations in check. Mm, right. 
So while the Alliance may appear to be at peace, the reality is that internal conflict is a routine matter. It actually vaguely reminds me of, um, the situation of, I forget the kingdom, or not kingdom, but the group's name, but the situation with Ro Roy's homeland and, uh, and, uh, the earlier Fire Emblems. Six, I think? Or was that seven? Or maybe it was five, I don't know. Of course, this leaves me precious little time to sit back and enjoy a cup of tea. Alas, I must be off. Let me join you. Sounds tough. Since you're here, perhaps you would care to accompany me on this little errand? Absolutely. I have no fear of Acheron, but it could be valuable for you to experience these political nuances firsthand. <laughs> sure thing, Lorenz, I can help you. The fate of the Alliance will someday rest upon my shoulders, so it is important to me that those I deal with understand its workings. What say you to broadening your horizons? I'll, I'll help you out, but, uh, you know, lay off it a little bit. Let's go. Excellent. Let us be away at once. The I shall leave the finer details the words, of the snobbery. in your capable hands. Not quite snobbery. Condescension. That's it. All right, let's take a look at the map. Hmm. Okay. Not a great bridge. Still, if this doesn't break out of wonder me, I don't know what will. Of course, we have these Pegasi, which could prove annoying. Ooh, another advanced seal, nice. And uh, he's a thief, of course, so I need to look for a chest. So nothing too special, except for we have a devil sword and the advanced seal to get. Okay. And to watch out for as well. Um, are there any chests? Does not look like it. Doesn't look like he's gonna steal anything, but he might try to escape. From where? Well, I can't say for sure. Maybe this way. We'll have to intercept him. We'll intercept right immediately. Uh, I'm not sure actually if we have the time. We'll try. Alright, everyone is set. Now let's just set some adjutants. Um, how about you and Flane? <laughs> and... Let's see. Bernadetta. And Marianne. There we go. Fantastic. All right, let us fight. Defeat the enemy commander or 12 turns pass. Okay. Far more enemies than I expected. I am glad you decided to come with us, Professor. Oh, this is a defense. Oh. And here I thought Count Gloucester would be too busy to send his soldiers here. That mustache and voice, oh my god, and that hair. Ah, well, it doesn't matter. I'll just have to deal with you little meddlers swiftly and decisively. Good luck. What are you doing? That is ah. If we can deal with him, that ought to scare the rest of these rats off. Oh, well, that wouldn't be fun, but we will. We need not actually kill him. So long as we cut his escape off convincingly enough, that should suffice. I want to kill him. Try to seize as much territory as they can. Be careful not to let them capture your defended location. Yep. Incidentally, take note of those drawbridges. They can only be operated from one of the banks. Yes. It is a route for us to get there. Be able to use that to our advantage. Well, first things first. Um, hand axe, hand axe. Um, ready and willing. Oof, 
No. Iron bow. Take him out. Actually. Out of curiosity. Leave it to me. Damn. Oh no. Ooh, so close. Um Damn it. Ready when you are. Did I forget to give you a, a bow? Stay focused. Don't worry. We'll correct that. Oh boy. Retrieve steel bow. Shoot. Oh well. Poor Cyril. But it's worth it. I stand ready. Hmm. Lawrence, um That's my cue. Can you heal? Stride now. Alright, uh, Bernie. Combat arts. Let's see, let's do curved shot if we can. Take him out. Training bow. Good shot. Get rid of the mage. They're dangerous. Alright, Hilda. Go and weaken him. Ooh, level 16. Eh, not a good one. That's okay. You've had plenty of good levels in your day. Good shot, Claude. It was a good try. All right, and last but not least, Dorothy. Uh, ooh, Gambit. Oh, it's the Strido. Oh, that's fine. Um, just wait. Come on, Cyril. Good. Dorothy, you're fine. Ho oh. ho. I've got many skills, you know. Yes, you do. Damn. Should have had him use his bow. Ow. Ooh, level 16, though. Level 20, and they can finally promote to advanced class. you going? You running away? Oh, you sneaky little bitch. I see what you're trying to do. You think we'll let you do that? You have another thing coming. To Seraphim. All right, Lysithia, hit him twice. Unless we'll be more efficient. Now we need to get rid of the mage. Mages are the most dangerous. And javelin. Unless, hmm. Yeah, javelin. Good that shot there, Sylvain. Nice. Guess I've gotten better. Uh, wait, right, um. Yeah, right, right here. No, right here is fine. Okay. As for you guys, um. Bernie? Mm, not quite. Iron bow will do it. Am I 
Hey, Diamond. <laughs> Poor Pegasus. Okay, Claude. Are there any others we have to watch out for? Let's keep an eye on you. And you. And you. And what the hell, let's keep an eye on you. Careful. That'll do it. Nice. Never underestimate an outsider. Alrighty. Um, Cyril. Not so sure about this. Can you finish him? Not quite. What about with the Iron Axe? No. Combat arts do you have? That would do it. Or no. Helm Splitter would do it as well. But he's not armored. Well, the axe is cheaper. Let's go for that. Nice. That worked out. Okay. As for this one, um, Leone, not quite, not good enough. I know, Hilda. Go ahead and hand axe him. Nice. And then... Finish him off, Lawrence. Magnificent. Good level. I'm still not satisfied. Really? Ragnarok. That sounds cool. Highest tier of fire magic. Hoo hoo. I look forward to seeing it. I shouldn't strain myself. What? Oh, your weekend. Um. I mean, not wrong. Wait here. Dorothea? Kill him. Goodbye. You were wide open. Yes, he was. But now we have to watch out for you. How much damage would you do to her? You'd kill her. Unless we weaken you. Nice. Should be able to come next turn. Gotta keep improving. You're doing fine, Leone. Damn, you missed Sylvain. Oh, this sucker. Going after Lysithia like that. Worst move he could make. Oh, fuck. They have Blaze. Oh. That could have been bad. And Lysithia continues to of butcher them. But I am still worried for her. Does having two crests cause physical harm to someone? Does it shorten their lifespan, perhaps? Crest of Gloucester. The Crest of Caron. Anyways, um, let's see, Lysithia. Go ahead and finish him. Unless. 
Actually, I should give uh, one of these kills to Cyril here. If possible. No? There we go. Finishing Cyril. Making Lady Rhea proud. <laughs> nice. Love your growths. Um. Okay. Do you need to finish him? Let's have. Let's have Bernie do it. Come on, Bernie. Damn it. Lucky bastard. Hope this is good for something. All right, then. Ooh. Come on, Claude. Shit. I'll have to, I might have to go back. use um, a different strategy. Careful. We might have them both attack it. Let's try that. Good shot, good shot. And then Bernie. 90%? Looks like 90% it is. Good job. Okay, now. Lysithia. Go ahead and finish him. Level 17. Nice. There's still a lot. And I'm Sylvain. Finish him. Be gone. Alright, uh go and a support Lysithia. for you. Yeah. Shouldn't. But will. Oh, wait. Um, Cyril. If I were to move Byleth. Damn, I can't move her into that spot. Well, if I remove her here, could you... By chance, take him out. Oof. Almost. Alright, finish him off with your bow. Nice. Won't lose next time either. No, you won't. I'll keep it God, up. I don't think you've had a bad growth yet. See. Hilda. Bridge. You can hold that off, right? I stand ready. Good. Um as for you, Leone. Let's get to it. Uh yeah. Iron Lance. Support there. We'll bring uh, Drothia over here. So she can get healed by Lysithia. Ooh, have you found something nice? Go ahead and hand it over. <laughs> oh? Oh? The escape route. Thieves, do not allow them to escape. Gotta use your head sometimes. We won't let them escape. Shouldn't be an issue. 
they are well they have a long ways to go and we can pretty effectively block this off pretty quickly especially that one coming right for us <laughs> We can ignore you now, Cyril. Finish him. Damn it. All right, then. So be it. Leone. What? Oh, damn it. Well, we need to kill this one. So that doesn't go around and uh, kill Cyril or someone. Should I have held back? Or capture the spot we're defending. Um, okay, wait right there. Lysithia. Go ahead and his sister. Yeah. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. And you, Sylvain. Hmm. This would prevent him from moving, right? Let's win this already. <laughs> Hell yeah. And now I can beat him in one turn. Alright, as for you two. See, probably could use the support over here or maybe over here. Or over here even, maybe. Ooh, Ragnarok. Oh, that would be a waste though. Damn it. Finish him off, Hilda. Sorry, did I hurt you? And he can't do much. Oof. Look at that. Nice. troubles yet, though it is a fun map. Poor Hilda. Alright, let's, um, come on. Let's finish them off. The enemy is on the move. Do not let them through. No worries. All right, um, you can finish off, actually. I could use a break. Go ahead, Hilda. Yeah. You lost to me? Now. Finish him off. Lovely. Really you have a lot of HP, Lawrence. Not bad. Okay, Leone, or actually let's start with Cyril, not enough again, huh, every time, that'll do, damn it, you just had to get a crit, didn't you? Yeah, go ahead and wait right here. Cyril? That would kill him.
both of you need healing pretty badly. Huh. You fought well. Two crests. Uh. Two crest uh, activations. It looked like. Uh, send the Lancer Rune. Uh, no. Training Sword to Convoy. Before I uh, decide what to do with Cyril, the Scythia. Ooh, not quite. How about with a Luna? Still not quite. That's my cue. Hmm. I do want to kill them. Quite good. Nope. No more people trying to escape. Um. Dead eye. Iron bow. Can we kill this guy? Not quite. Maybe. Curve shot. Training bow. Better. Shot, Bernie. Now. Beautiful. You were outmatched. Yes, he was. How can I protect them? Uh, this should probably be fine protection purposes. Hopefully. Hopefully that's enough for you, Cyril. Oh, he decided not to target you after all. Even if he could hit, he doesn't do damage. Poor guy. Same with him. Good job, Dorothea. Everyone's doing excellently right now. Dodge there, uh, Lysithia. Ooh, and Flane. Good. They say experience. Oh, after Lysithia as well. Yeah, it would have been bad. I would have had to go. I would have had to use a time power. What the? Okay, that just happened. Um. Alright, so he's about to die. Right? Is that the. Oh, wait. No, he's about to. Flying guy. Is about to die. There we go. Yes, it does. It really does. A Sithy can tell you all about that. Alright, uh, Dorothea. Beautiful. I won't go down so easily. And finally. Oh, I'm curious. Based on the unit's resistance, huh? Nice. I wanna s that'd be fun. I wanna see this. Cool. 
It's over. Alrighty then. Hmm. Uh -huh. Battalion desperation. I think a few other people have that already. Finish him. That one is expected. There we go. And see, as for you guys, um, well, oh, not enough. Let's do Ragnarok again. Beautiful. Magnificent. Alrighty. Cyril. I'm not hurt too bad. Can you? It's your call. Can you not assist here? <laughs> Effectively, that is. Sorry, but victory is mine. Nice. Good level. For the battalion. Damn it. So with that, sure. Ooh, that's prowess level four. All right, steel bow, finish him. There you go, Cyril. Yeah, I won. All right, they're gonna target them. Him? Can he take it? Yeah, he can take it. But I can't really move. Uh, actually, I can move Byleth. So it's really strong sword, but no matter what, always does damage to you. Or no, that's just him hitting me. We'd love to experiment with it. Ah, screw it. We'll just let things play out how they do. Perfect. Nice. Should that I triggers often, back? it seems like. All right, Cyril. Finish him. Guess I'm pretty strong. Yes, you are getting there. Careful. All right, Claude has the vulnerary. I think we'll let, um, who are you gonna attack, Claude? Yeah, we'll let that play out again. We have plenty of turns left after all. There we go, seven turns. Or we're on turn seven. Seven or eight turns. Um. Can we lure you out? Well, I guess let's lure you out first. There you go, Sylvain. And Bernie. Oh, is he going to move? He might. We'll see. Just in case, damn. How much damage can he do? Enough. Let's back off. Okay, six turns remaining. Uh, the iron axe broke. Damn it. I need to do some thorough repairs. Good, good, good. Okay, we'll take care of the right flank first. Um, Who gets what kill? You're all doing pretty fantastically. 
Um, Dorothea. There you go. Winning's always nice. Ooh, nice. Um, yes, it is always nice to win. And finish him off. You're out of luck. B plus. Nice. Got it. Good to go. All right. Let's first deal with. Oh, you or not? I guess. Um. That would do it. Maybe. Perfect. Now, Cyril can definitely get that kill. Beautiful. That's what you get. And you can just use your vulnerary. All right. And you two can back off. I don't want to kill him yet, even on accident. Down to this. Oh shit. Okay, good. Alright. How many more enemy troops are there? Just them, huh? Perfect. Alright, Cyril, first off, what can you do against. I can't even see. Um, how about, we'll start with this. And then Cyril, move in and finish him. Guess I'm pretty strong. Nice. Like Not as nice as your other levels, but nice. And then it's your call. Hmm. Not enough, huh? So close. What about? Training acts not enough. Nor with the diamond decks. Absolutely finish you off, Byleth. That is that. Oof, nice. We must all do our part. Beautiful, beautiful. Um, yeah, Claude. Can you finish him like that? No. Ooh, that would do it if you hit. Also acceptable, except for he would then kill Cyril. All right, Diamond Axe it is. Nice. It was a good try. That's everybody. Good. All right, you ready for this uh, showdown here, Lawrence? First off, Ragnarok. Actually, we'll finish him with Ragnarok, maybe. We are in the right. If you try to remain <laughs> here any longer, what you'll kill me? A tiny kid like Ooh. you kill someone like me? <laughs> oh, that's too funny. I like that VA. He's awesome. Um, uh, I I don't know about you, Lawrence, but I'm uh, I'm down. I'm game. An animal like you cannot be allowed to run amok. We will settle this here and now. 
If you think you're up to the task, then by all means. But it's not my fault if it ends You are bad. going down. <laughs> Blizzard. All right. It's his range. Good. All right. Asheron or Akron. What? Who are you? I'd appreciate it if you could just not get in my way. Do you way. have pass? You won't like this. Resonant lightning. Oof. Look what he missed. Damn. Okay, then. In that case... Do we have... Disturbance. Good. First, though... Can I equip Ragnarok? Got this. Oh, I have an idea. <laughs> what? That was a. Oh no, it was forty percent. I honestly thought it was higher. Do you happen to have a vulnerary? Good. I need that. You can have that broken iron axe. Excellent. All right, what are you gonna do, Asheron? Got for Hilda, huh? Poor girl. But you're dead. No way you're surviving anymore. Uh, no, we're not gonna give Byleth the kill. It does belong to you, Lawrence. If at all possible. Damn it. That backfired. Careful, please. What you, Leone? Do you got this? There we go. Now is Ragnarok this enough? Is that is the question. Yes, it is. Goodbye, Asheron. <laughs> and good job, Lawrence. Nice. What was that about you shit talking, Lawrence? There. It's your call, Lawrence. What do you say? You have my thanks, Professor. Please go on ahead. I will clean up here and then report to my father. So be it. See you back at the monastery. Do tell me the juicy details of what you do with him, though. Oh, I gotta go Cyril. The Gluster Knights. Should probably give them to uh, Lawrence. Your assistance in this incident with Acheron has it is Acheron. Most essential. Consider me in your debt. You are more than welcome. Thanks to you, the Alliance was able to nip this internal conflict in the bud. What will become of him? He has written a pledge to my father, swearing never to cause trouble about the border again. And if he does? Of course, he is hardly the type to bind himself in good faith to anything written on paper. But Acheron has many connections, both in the Alliance and I mean, the Empire. You are by a river. He could have accidentally slipped and uh, drowned. To remove him entirely would cause more conflict. We will just have to watch him closely for now. You know? 
You handled this quite well, actually, Lawrence. Maybe you will be a really good leader of your house. That is a prudent decision. Indeed. I do plan to eliminate him eventually, however. He is nothing but trouble. <laughs> I can appreciate that. Incidentally, there was one other benefit to embarking upon this Ooh. errand. Have a look at this. What is it? The magic staff oh. of Thursis, a relic passed down through House Gloucester for generations. Is this how we get all the holy relics? Through these kinds of missions? It seems my father has finally recognized my ability. That's awesome. It's too bad I didn't get one for Ingrid, but Apparently he had no, I did get a ring though. Trusting this relic to me for some time. He has had precious few opportunities to take to the field of battle personally of late. All right. Doubtless by giving this to me, he intends to send the message that I must work even harder. <laughs> I will certainly continue to do my utmost, but I am by no means completely subservient to his will. Of course. It's all not well between you? Or do you disagree with your father's opinions? I would not go so far as that. But my father seldom thinks beyond the immediate benefit of our house. Whereas you are concerned with the benefit of the Alliance. While that is important, I prefer to consider the greater good when I make decisions. Well, you've, uh, ticked up a few marks of, uh, respect from me there, Lawrence. I believe that is a noble's duty. Even if you are incredibly pompous. Now, for the time being, may I trust you to decide how we may best make use of Thursus? Sure. For the moment, I think you are in the best position to apply it to the betterment of all, Fodlan. Are you sure? I mean, I'm just gonna give it to you. Quite honest, I am not certain I feel ready to decide the fate of a relic on my own just yet. Do me this favor, Professor, and I will be grateful. Now to celebrate, allow me to treat you to Fan freaking tastic. I love tea. I don't think I've ever actually had a tea time with Lawrence. I'm not gonna send that to Convoy either. The Devil Sword. Okay, let's go banish some bandits. <sighs> banish the bandits. Here we go. And looks like, unfortunately, it is. Oh, actually, no. Wait. Oh yeah, no, it's just the, uh, it's just this map again. In which case, I'll probably just, especially since I'm overleveled for this one, probably just skip ahead. Huh. I can choose not to field Byleth. That's cool. How do you like that? Alright, in with that. We are done with this. <laughs> Excellent. Ooh, nice. Fantastic.